Katie and I have been friends since the first grade. I look up to you in so many ways. You're motivated, kind-hearted, and selfless. You put your family and friends before yourself each and every day. You make sure we always have a good time when we are together. Justin, I'm so happy you and Katie have found each other. I love the way she lights up when you walk into the room or when she talks about you. You bring out the best in each other. We can all hope for a love like you two have. you two to take a moment and look around the room. This is a rare moment in your life where all the people you love and care about come together to celebrate your love for each other. We all can't wait to see where your love story takes you. Thanks everyone for coming. Now let's cheers to the new Mr. and Mrs. Cass. Cass is a quiet guy. I think everybody knows him, knows he's pretty quiet. And you might ask, well, why is that such a good quality? Well, if you're good friends with Michael Knudsen after a few beers, he never stops talking. <laughs> so somebody's got to listen to him. <laughs> but it's funny because his best man, Mitch Hansen's also a quiet guy, hence the 10 minute speech he just gave. But they're both hardworking, quiet guys who do anything for you. Another thing about Justin Castro, and I think a lot of us know, is he loves 80s music. If you go mushroom hunting with this guy with nothing but a 30 box, no phones, anything, there'll be Michael Jackson playing in the background after about eight years. So he's a quiet guy who loves 80s music. And the third thing about him is his age. He's the oldest person in our grade, which was great for me because I always had a ride. He had his license before he, he was a freshman in high school. When I was graduating high school, everybody said, you know, what are you going to do? Are you going to go to college? Where are you going to go to college? The, the typical questions. And I said, yeah, I'm going to go to college. And they said, where are you going to go? I said, I don't know, wherever Castron's going. And they're like, well, why would you do that? Well, the guy turns 21 next week. Why wouldn't I go with him? <laughs> Cass is a quiet guy. But during my wedding, he stood up and said something, which meant a lot to me because I never expected him to. And he said, a good friend will come bail you out of jail, but a best friend will be sitting right there with you. And that always meant a lot to me. Congratulations, you two. Katie, you're getting a hell of a guy. And I wish you guys the best. Thank you, everybody, for coming tonight. Hopefully, you're having a good time. And uh, just like to thank uh, 
my mom and my dad and Deanna and uh, Katie's parents, Brian and Karen, for everything they've done to make this day that special. Um, also, grandparents and uh, host hostess. We appreciate everything that you've done. Music will start in a little bit. Have a good time.